rookie Connor Daly. His dad started six starts, Buddy Lazier and Catherine Legg. Mike King, here they come. Well, we watched the alignment. Looks pretty good through the first four rows. Now row five and six off of turn number four. This is a good looking alignment, and it looks like the green flag will wave. It's Ed Carpenter. He'll jump to the front early. The rookie Munoz will look to the inside, and Marco Andretti, he'll look to the outside, but Ed Carpenter is the leader in turn number one. Ed Carpenter pulls away now from Carlos Munoz. <laughs> Club, oh. uh, and we've got a problem. Jake that's, Query. That's in the south end of the track in turn number one. A car got loose between turns one and two and comes to a stop. I believe it's J.R. Hildebrand, but I can't get a complete view. It is indeed J.R. Hildebrand who, as a rookie, made contact in turn number four at this. <laughs> certainly does, but not only that, every time he makes a move like that, this crowd goes nuts. Race for the lead, headed to you, Mark James, in turn number three. Well, he's getting squeezed to the bottom of the racetrack by Carpenter. Now Ed dances up high, leaves room for TK. You saw in Side by Side the swap going twice between that man, Tony Kanaan, and here comes Marco Andretti wanting to lead again. And he takes the lead down into turn number one. There's Zavedra on the far right. Ooh. Yeah, he got chopped. Oh, boy, did he catch that for as little damage as he has, as Eddie said. Wow. He had made no contact, and he's trying to get the safety workers just to fire him up so he doesn't go a lap down, but did a good job by keeping it out of the wall. But watch after he does the 360. You can tell he tries to gas it up again and keep continue going right there. Behind him is Andretti, Carpenter, Kanan, and Will Power. He will not be leading, turning into one. Marco looks to the inside. <laughs> AJ Allmendinger is going to pass that one, but two cars going into turn number seventh running. He's trying to close in on Tony Kanaan into three. Yeah, he might not be done. Takes a look to the bottom side in his rookie year. A.J. Allmendinger leads at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Look at Marco. He, there he goes. Because Castro Nevis is right behind him. And Elio Castro Nevis, who has not led today, now goes around both of them. And all of a sudden, here with 56 laps to go, Elio starts to flex his muscle. Very unfortunately, Sebastian Bourdais slams the car into the wall and then slams the cowling with his fist. Now my question is, is there any debris on the track, Scott? Jamie? Brad Keedy is in, Hinch is in, and uh, Tony Kanaan has gone back out in front, Mark James, and now the leaders in front of Kristen Airy in turn number four. Has the lead, trying to hold off Ryan hunter Ray. Oh. One, two, hunter Ray ducks inside. Here they come across the line, Ryan hunter Ray in the set drop, DHL machine with 188 of 200 laps complete, Jake Query, Ryan hunter Ray has gone to the top of the leaderboard. The Homatro safety crew and the track crew, Davey, they have been on their game. They've gotten incidents cleaned up very, very quickly. This happened uh, coming off of turn number two, almost the exact same situation we saw with Takuma Sato, but this should be a relatively quick cleanup, but we're probably going to have a three or four lap shootout. Well, one reason it's going to be a quick cleanup, he didn't hit the outside wall, just the inside wall, so all the debris is way down on the inside in the grass, actually, oh. and uh, so they shouldn't have a lot to clean up, but unfortunately, Graham was having a decent race, but... Uh, yeah, just uh, lost control coming off of turn two. And Ryan hunter Ray is off and running. He's got Kanan behind him on the inside as Mark Andretti trying to make a move from fourth. 197 laps complete at the line. Three wide, Munoz on the outside, Kanan on the inside. Who will make the pass miss stick? It's going to be Kanan, Jake Query, TK out in front on lap 197 at the speedway. Kanan was going all or nothing and restart and he gets all. Oh, there's a yellow and it's because of one of the target cars. 
His countryman and friend, Elio Castro Nevis, has won this race three times. The first one is always the sweetest. He's behind the pace car in turn four, Mike King. Here comes Tony Kanaan. TK has wanted this race oh so bad. The crowd will come to its feet and will salute the man from Brazil who will finally fulfill his dream for Tony Kanaan. The 12th time is the charm at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, the twin checkers way. TK has won the 2013 500. Let's go to Nick Yeoman. And I'll tell you what, Mike, there is not a dry eye down in this pit lane. Kevin Kalkovin, Jimmy Vassar will go to victory lane at Indianapolis. 